we're just practicing a little low distraction leash rocking. She's doing pretty well. Um, a teensy bit of pulling off to the side, but nothing really crazy. Uh, I'm still feeding her fairly frequently, just by my side as usual, right behind my leg. Let's go. She's a good girl. And Lily's up ahead, which sometimes is tricky for her. She wants to be with her, but she's doing really well. I'm just having her practice um, waiting as well because I find that she gets a little bit bored and then she just starts doing her own thing. So just sitting beside me in heel position because she'll start to just kind of come and stand in front or she'll go darting off to the side. So as long as she's in here, I don't care if she's sitting or not. She wants to do a little sniff, that's fine. But I'm going to reposition her if she sits facing me. So this is pretty easy for her. We'll do some more in 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 public walks. With a little pulling there. Always have her come back as soon as she gets out of position. Good girl. I think the hotter she gets, the less. I'm gonna let her go because she's doing good. Good girl. Okay. Toy. Good girl. You get a ball. Oh, you got happy girl. Oh, you got happy girl. Oh, yeah, let's see. Can I see? Okay. Ready? Good job. So when you're off leash, one way to keep her close is just to bring a ball with you. So when you do your off leash walks. Just be playing with her while you're walking. Um, and you won't get the same kind of zooming and stuff going on. And it's just a really nice tool that you have in your toolbox because she really loves stretching. So I wouldn't just consider it a leisure activity. You can use it as a reward for your recall as well. Good job. Good girl. Come on. And you can use it for all kinds of stuff. You can use the ball as a reward for healing, too. So if I hold the ball here. Here, show. That ball is yucky. Good boy, girl. Drop, please. Shell. Good girl. Okay. Um, I can get her back into heel position here. There you go. Just guiding her with my hand. Very nice. And I can have her walk with me a couple steps. A little jumping is okay if the ball is exciting. Yes, go. And then throw it. So just a little, you know, you can practice things like that with her, with the ball, while you're walking. And that encourages her to stay close when you're off leash as well. Because she's so focused. Mom, wait. 